Yay, on the way to the Eva Fleece photo shoot. And I forgot my sash because I didn't realize that I needed it. So, trying to get to the place, which is a bit of a nightmare with this elevator. But we are going there. Osman from when I first came to the US and she came to see me compete. And yes, yes, I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> this is gonna be so amazing. So we're about to go to the cruise mm -hmm. and we'll take you with us. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not coming. She's not coming. We are, we are poor, so. <laughs> we're sure about that. <laughs> love it. Yeah, so yeah, we're gonna take you with us, although I'm gonna film on the phone because this is too big to take. Welcome to International Miz 2022, United Kingdom, Soraya Barrera. Soraya is representing the United Kingdom, a country that welcomed her with open arms, but her roots are from Spain and Colombia. Leading a team of 44 women at a localization company, she is also a boss babe with a very successful makeup company that specializes in pageantry and bodybuilding. Virginia, Bilakisu Adiemi. United Kingdom. She started pageantry to fulfill a childhood dream and then fell in love, realizing the impact and change she can make with the title. She believes pageantry allows women to be trailblazers for their own advocacies and inspiring the next generation of women. Last but not least, Virginia. She participates in
Virginia. Selected by her peers as the most welcoming and friendly delegate, the Congeniality Award goes to United Kingdom. This meant the world to me, like being recognized by everybody to be the most welcoming delegate, it's amazing. Plus, Miss Congeniality, of course, like the movie. <laughs> High Point Social Media, United Kingdom. This was also one of the most important awards for me because I put so much effort and so much work into the social media leading up to the final, so it's amazing being recognized. Next up, United Kingdom. You have no idea how nervous I was when they were announcing the top 10 because they announced me mostly at the end and I was like, there is not that many more spaces left in the top 10. Oh my God, I didn't make it. This is horrible, blah, blah, blah. And finally they called my name. Phew. Come on up from the back, Tennessee. United Kingdom. I'm an entrepreneur, a leader in the pharma field, but most of all, I'm an advocate. Thousands of lives are lost every year to melanoma. This is why I made it my mission to start a petition to get it to parliament, as well as start the Swap Your Tongue campaign to ensure that we all tan safely and ban sun beds. A legacy I wanna leave is, it's never too late to chase your dreams. I will inspire women all over the world to reach their full potential and I know I am capable of being the change the world needs us to be. Thank you. Your second runner-up, United Kingdom. Oh, well, not the result that we wanted. I didn't bring home the crown, but a third place is not that bad. But there were so many girls, so I'm happy about placing third. It was obviously a disappointment, but after the show, we had booked um, a table at Panorama Room, which is in Roosevelt Island, and we just went for some cocktails to kind of like forget about <laughs> not having one. <laughs> we had some cocktails, but the most important part of this was spending time with my family and my friends and getting to enjoy the New York City views at night. Look how gorgeous this is. If you ever come to New York, make sure that you book a table at Panorama Room and enjoy the views at night because seriously, it's breathtaking. Well, I hope you liked this vlog and looking forward to show you more of the things that I get up to.